Passable Bros down 30 points right now in the fourth, man. It's not looking good for y'all. Make sure you tell them a price beforehand so you don't get scammed. Saying you's a real demon in another country where you don't speak the language is ignorant behavior. And you're not using your common sense. It, Y'all know how the passport bros get down. So apparently, the transaction wasn't living up to his expectations. Meaning that they agreed on a price. And then she upped the price at the last minute. Based on how he acted, I could see why she upped the price on the, in the last minute. Nah, I, get, I got the down. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Well, you not talk so much. You ain't talking. Why you she hardly talks to him. Oh, she, she should be good, bro. I'm not like, she should. It's, 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 a, it's a thousand now. You, you good, then. Wait, time out. No sexual. You good. You good. Don't enjoy. Damn, boy came out of the... He said, no sexual. You good. No, you good. 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 What is that? Nah, what is that? <laughs> so the other dude is mad because Shorty, I guess, is not feeling him, so she tried to up the price at the last minute. That's that's pretty much what, what transpired. She wasn't feeling you. And then while all of this commotion is going on, my man right here, he trying to set something up for tomorrow. I you know what? I feel him. <laughs> Unless you want to die 911. Son. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. I'm not gonna lie. Maybe he maybe maybe he is a demon, bro. Calling 911 on a chick in another country because she decided she didn't want to sleep with you. That's demon activities. That is demon activities, bro. Don't never, don't never do that, man. I fucking shoot the way I 
I should have got everything in hand over that shit, but you know, this is this this is what shit come with. You feel me? I'm from I'm from Chicago, so I'm used to getting hey, you feel me? I'm used to getting bamboos and finesse. I've been finessed all the time. You feel me? So why should I be surprised now? These bitches out here no different. They no different. On on G, they no different. But you know, I'm not gonna go um went wrong. Yeah, so someone oh bro. This, uh, yeah, this happens a lot, you know. I gotta I gotta actually do a, a video talking about this shit. This happens a lot. Bro. Yeah, bro, a girl shit. Bro, it's that's why I like fucking with big girls. It's so corny to me, dog. It's all me. This is so I ain't gonna lie, this is so corny to me. Me look for you, okay. What? Oh she said me look for you, okay. She gonna look for you. I can't understand that shit. I ain't gonna lie. That shit sounds like gibberish, right? They're on my side, bro. What the hell? Hey. I'm in there, hey, I know every time I do a video on the Passport Bros, I get, you know, there's a few of y'all in the comment section that's just not feeling me. My thing about the whole Passport Bros movement is the, the dudes that I see making videos on this whole situation. You know? Growing up, I'm pretty sure we all have this one friend that we wouldn't invite if we had girls over the crib. Because somehow or the other, he gonna mess it up. And that's what I see when I look at a lot of these dudes that make videos, like Passport Bros videos. If I was chilling with some girls, I wouldn't invite you over. At first, the whole thing was hiding under the disguise of, yo, we going to these countries, man. We going to find submissive women and this, that, and the third. And, okay, whatever. Even though me, I knew what it was. I knew what it was. Ain't nothing wrong going to another country and having fun. It's dudes out here who go to other countries with their wives. And, you know, they they have threesomes and stuff like that. And that's, that's fine. That's what you want to do. You feel me? Whether you want to go out there and pay for it, you want to go out there and have fun, it is what it is. But the videos and the people making the videos, I just feel as though they're going to mess it up for everybody. I ain't the coolest ice cube in the fridge, but at the same time, bro, you got a bunch of that don't got no swag, that ain't wavy, they don't know how to talk to women, they don't know how to treat women right, going over to these countries and giving us a bad reputation. Now it's going to seem... Like, every black man that comes to the Dominican Republic from America is a trick. He's coming out here to trick. If me and you catch a lick, and we know it's a continuous lick that, that we can catch, I don't need you to be telling everybody. That makes sense? I don't need you to be telling everybody. Shh.